Do you find yourself frequently referring to the command prompt to see what information MicroStation is looking for? When working with the various tools and features found in MicroStation, it is very common to frequently refer to the command prompt located in the lower left corner of the user interface. This prompt helps identify what is needed next and is part of the three-step rule for working with commands in MicroStation. The general three-step rule is 1. Pick the tool. 2. Adjust the settings in the tool settings window. And 3. Follow the prompt. This is located in the lower left corner of the MicroStation application. And while observing the prompt in the lower left corner of the application window has long been the standard in MicroStation, a new option is available. You can display the command prompt at the cursor pointer by simply setting the value of a configuration variable. This is accomplished by setting the configuration variable ms underbar cursor prompt equal to 1. The default value of this variable is undefined. This will then display a cursor prompt window that will follow the mouse on screen. Let's set the ms underbar cursor prompt configuration variable. To do this, we begin by opening the configuration variables dialog. An easy way to access this dialog is through MicroStation's integrated ribbon search. Typing in a few characters from the word configuration will easily provide a short list of search results. Let's go ahead and type in CONF. You can then easily open the configuration variables dialog by clicking configuration variables. Now, locate the desired variable. In the search field, type in prompt. You can see the ms underbar cursor prompt in the list of configuration variables that are displayed. Pick ms underbar cursor prompt. As can be seen, the value is currently set to undefined. This is the default value provided when MicroStation is first installed. Click the Edit button. And, in the new value, type 1 and click OK. The change to the variable will be written to the personal configuration file, personal.ucf, that is by default located in the User Preferences folder. This is illustrated by User Personal that is displayed on the title bar of the dialog. Once the new value has been provided, in the Configuration Variables dialog, Click OK, and in the resulting alert dialog, click Yes to save the changes. Now, exit and restart MicroStation. It is typically considered a best practice to exit and restart MicroStation after setting or modifying the value of a configuration variable. Now that MicroStation has restarted, in the View window, observe the cursor prompt following the mouse. This can be an effective way to view the prompt information. Note, system administrators and CAD managers can set this for multiple users by adding this variable to a configuration file located within their configuration. An example of this might be a corporate standards or workgroup configuration file, allowing this to affect all users that access that configuration file. If you found this video helpful, please give it a like. If you want to see more such series, consider subscribing to our channel. Thank you, and see you next time.